All right, all right. LDBC, this is your boy Coach Shelton Harrison. You're live, live, live on the Coach Shelton Harrison Combat Sports Show Live. Okay, folks, I'm going to go ahead and uh, I'm going to address this because I'm getting several messages. And, you know, and sometimes it just it just seems like, you know, the more you tell people stuff, people just don't listen. Like, what what is it with people on YouTube? What is it with people on YouTube? I, I, I have to wonder, are these people deaf? Or are they just dumb? Or what, what, what is it? With people who don't listen. You know, and I've been ignoring a lot of messages. Coach, man, you know, really, man, your thoughts, man, on Nipsey Hussle, bro. I'm disappointing you, man. Why you ain't putting no thoughts out there? What you mean you disappointed me? See, you know what? I'm going to tell you something. It's called integrity. It's called integrity and it's called common sense. Something that your stupid self don't have. Something that your stupid self don't have, okay? It's called, it's, it's called integrity and common sense. Okay, first of all, with all the people making videos, okay, and I'm going to tell you something. With all the people making goofy videos, and I'm not talking about people who are making, like, you know, really good content, okay, really good content. They're not, you know, saying that they got facts. They're speaking opinions. I, I can deal with those people who they have a theory, they have an opinion, but they're they're not substantiating any of this. I can deal with those people because I know that those people are genuinely, you know, really you know, upset about it, and they, they want to put their thoughts out. We're not talking about those people. No, I'm talking about all these people who, who they so intelligent. They so damn smart. They so smart. They know just exactly what's going on. They just know everything. Okay, they're putting out these goofy videos. And you know what? I understand that the 19 and 20, 20 something yos, I know that they're going to do lazy stuff like this. See, I started really figuring out because I, did, I didn't listen to the guy. And it's like I have to tell people over and over, you know, I didn't even know who he was. I didn't listen to his music. I don't listen to modern hip hop. I just that's just not my genre. But you can't people just don't listen. People don't listen. They think just because I'm black, I'm supposed to talk about everything that every other black person talk about. OK, I'm, I'm supposed to automatically, even though I, I don't even listen to modern rap. I mean, I, <laughs> people are stupid. People don't listen. They don't they're not subjective to anything. They want you to do everything. Listen. A lot of people got some very good videos out about Nipsey Hussle. Why, why don't you go, you know, see, see what they want to say? But I tell you this, when I started researching the guy, I started, when, when I really started researching who he was, you know, this guy stood for something. This guy appeared to have stood for something. This guy worked for everything he got. This guy was grinding. And it's something we got so many lazy ass people, okay, putting up videos trying to get a come up. You know, and that's something, oh man, I got love for Nipsey Hussle, but then they got like 20 ads all across the video. They got 20 ads all across the video, but they got love for them. Y'all people trying to get a come up. Y'all trying to get y'all a million views on YouTube to get you a come up. Okay, that, that, that's just what it is. You guys are trying to get a come up. Okay, you don't want to work for nothing. Isn't that the problem in our community? Isn't that the problem? You know, I see a bunch of people. Okay, they, they got all these theories and, you know, they got all these things that they're passing off as facts. Now we got a lot of philosophers in the black community. And, I, and I'm sitting here thinking to myself, you're a philosopher? Really? I mean, what, what the? <laughs> God, dog. You know, it, 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 it baffles me. I'm talking about we got OGs. We got wave cap, gold teeth heaven, okay, spectrum glasses, uh, 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 they're in pigeon toe, uh, you know, uh, stocking sock wearing OGs, sitting here making videos, goofy videos about a conspiracy theory. About a conspiracy theory. And I'm like, what? what who conspired to kill him? It, it was a dude. That ran up on Nipsey Hussle. I mean, y'all, yeah, you saw the video. Oh yeah, man, that guy. He brought, he brought the, the FBI brought him in. Really? And then I listen. I'm a guy that'll tell you if something is a conspiracy theory. I'll tell you that because people don't even know who Dr. Sabi is. But the events leading up to Dr. Sabi death, I, I know. I, I I got behind the scenes. Like I've spent time with Dr. Sabi. I know some of his people. Look, I know some things that happened. So if anybody tried to tell me that he wasn't murdered, I'm not listening to that. I don't, I don't, I don't want to hear that. Because I know some things behind the scenes. But I'm not going to put it out on a video. I'm not going to do that. But I tell you what, I know. Look, man. Some of y'all are so dumb and so stupid. Do you know if somebody is doing something on behalf of the FBI? You know they're not going to do jail time. You know they're not going to do any jail time. Now, ain't it funny this guy is doing jail time? How are you going to explain that? He's doing jail time. He's in jail. You think they're going to let him out of there? 
if he was an FBI, you know, if he was put up by the FBI, y'all people are stupid. Y'all are stupid. And you got OGs. I'm talking about you got 55 year old, 50 something year old OGs putting these kind of goofy videos out. I'm talking about man, these dudes old enough to be somebody granddaddy five times. And I'm talking about OGs running around here talking about the FBI. Man, if you don't believe this, you 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 awoke. Man, look, you, you sleep. Y'all dudes been asleep. Some of you dudes been asleep on the weed. Some of you dudes been falling asleep on alcohol. Some of you dudes been snorting cocaine and you asleep. You guys been asleep. And y'all talking about y'all trying to wake somebody up. Y'all wake up. You dudes wake up. Because y'all, you know, some of these, y'all ain't like y'all revolutionaries. Y'all ain't no revolutionary. Coming to YouTube don't make you a revolutionary. Coming to YouTube does not make you a revolutionary. You're not a revolutionary on YouTube. See, let me tell you the difference between you guys uploading these goofy videos. And I'm not talking about the people who are honestly giving their opinion. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about these people that's looking for a come up. That's got 20, you got 20 or 30 ads on a video. Talking about Nipsey Hustle, But y'all swear y'all love Nipsey so much. Oh, y'all love Nipsey so much. How much ad sense are you getting on Nipsey Hustle videos? For those of y'all that keep putting Nipsey uh, videos out there. Nipsey Hustle videos out there. I mean, how much ad sense? But y'all really care about the the, 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 the black diaspora. Y'all y'all care about that. I, I'm, I'm, I ain't trying. I ain't trying to hit that man. I can see right through a lot of people that's just not real. I, man, I ain't trying to hit. Y'all don't want to do what Nipsey else did. This man grinded, and y'all want to sit and make a video and get a come up off this man's name after this man spent years and over a decade grinding, being away from his family. Okay, uh, sacrificing everything that he had to get to where he was. <laughs> wow. Wow. It, you know, and it's amazing, man. It's amazing. But this, these are the kind of things that happen in the black community. These are the kind of things. These are the kind of things. How many people making videos actually bought clothing from the marathon store? How many people? I, I know town business did. How many people actually bought marathon clothing? But y'all love Nipsey so much. Well, how many of y'all made an excuse, man? I can't even get out there. Oh, well, you know, he got an online store. How many of y'all actually supported? Or how many of y'all took y'all tail back to Gucci? Took your tail back to, you know, even if you buy clothes at Walmart and Target. How many of y'all took y'all tails back there instead of ordering clothes from the Marathon store? But y'all love Nipsey so much. Y'all love him so much you can't stand it. A lot of y'all dudes is lazy. A lot of y'all dudes don't know how to work for nothing. Most, a lot of you dudes, y'all don't get up out the house. Y'all jokers, half of y'all don't, don't even have a place of employment. And I'm not saying that's a bad thing. If you're looking for employment and you still, you going out every day hitting the pavement, I got you. But some of you guys, the problem with y'all is that you're lazy. You're lazy. And y'all don't want to do what's necessary to actually get to where you got to go. You want to do what's easy to get there. So what's the easiest thing to do to get you YouTube viewers? Oh, talk about Dempsey Hustle. Ain't no ads on this video. Ain't no ads on this video. It ain't gonna be no ads on this video. First of all, I didn't even know him. I didn't even know, I didn't understand his music until I just started researching. You know, a lot of people talking about this guy. Who was he? This man worked his ass off. But uh, you know, it's a shame though, man. And I'm looking at OGs, man. Remember, the young crew, the, the, the 19 and 20 year, I understand why they do it. They ain't got no sense. A lot of them don't have sense. But you OGs, man, some of you dudes, y'all disgusting. Y'all a disgrace. Some of you OGs are a disgrace. Some of you running around here with, you know, like five generations of grandkids. Some of you dudes got on bifocal glasses talking about a conspiracy theory. We can make up a conspiracy theory about your glasses. Why the prescription so thick? We can do that. But ain't nobody doing that because ain't nobody going to believe that. The brother that killed Nipsey Hussle is in jail. He ain't no FBI informant. He ain't no FBI working behind the scenes. Okay, the dude not even that smart. He not even that smart. Okay, the guy that killed Nipsey, he's he not smart. If he was smart, then, well, that's a whole nother subject for another video. A little common sense goes a long way. A little common sense goes a long way. And I just think, you know, it's, it's amazing that you OGs are not using any common sense. Y'all not y'all are reckless, man. I mean, y'all are reckless. Y'all talking about the man family. Y'all better be careful, man. Y'all better hope, man, that look, somebody, you know, catch one of y'all videos and then somebody come looking for y'all. And then, <laughs> boy, 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 
People just don't get it. People just don't get it. But you will get it, but it'll be too late by the time you do. 